Welcome to Good Mythical More. It's time for the Baby Bell Olympics. It's an annual thing. It is now. First annual Baby Bell Olympics. Woo! But first, let's play Who You Talking About. This is when we read a comment that you made on a video of ours and we guess whether it was about me or Link. Okay. Victoria Thompson said, I could watch blank eat wings all day. That's art, man. Um, well, Rhett, you know what? I could watch you eat wings all day, but I do think this is about me. Because I I, I think that huh. I, I did the trick that we, that we tried on the show years ago. You know early. what? I did that later, and I remember seeing comments about it. This could be about either one of us, and here's why. Because you did it you later. Because you did it, and I saw comments about it. And then you and wanted then to, I, well, no, you wanted to get I was, in on no, that. No, I didn't know what you were doing. I was doing the technique that I found on a TikTok, which is similar, but slightly different, where you make this, what they call the, the, the umbrella situation. Yeah, umbrella. And I was trying to do that. And so, but I don't, you know I don't, what? I don't do you, the since you did it first on the show, I'm gonna go, this is about Link. There we go. Is it? <laughs> it is, Victoria Thompson and 1.2 thousand people agreed. Oh, wow. Um, okay, now first of all, the Baby Bell Olympics is something that, you know who came up with it? Clara. Ah, oh, shoot, I dropped one more. I think that's, we'll be that's fine. That's gonna stink I, like four months from now. Yeah, actually I think it gets better with time. So Clara decided, uh, came up with this idea for the, us to do the Baby Bell Olympics and then she came up with all the different events that we're going to do. And so between doing events, we're going to be creating voicemails that you can use as your voicemail greeting if you're so inclined. Okay. You wanna start with the first one? Thanks for calling the phone of a mythical beast. If you were trying to reach animal control, you got the wrong number. And if you're trying to call a pizza place, this is also not that. And if you want like a quote for like plumbing work, uh, I mean, I guess we could work something up. But you can leave a message and someone will get back to you. So if you use that one, you're gonna have to give a plumbing quote probably. Right, 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 right. Okay, Stevie, you're gonna tell us what we're doing here? Oh boy, am I. The first challenge is the stacking challenge, and it's pretty straightforward. Oh, I was already stacking. It's just instinctive when you got these things. You will compete to see who can stack 15 Baby Bell cheeses on top of each other the fastest. Okay. On your mark. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What are you doing? Yep, yep, no, yep, yep, no, I'm yep, just feeling yep. them out. Yep, yep. Is it one singular thing? Do that again. Is it one singular thing? <laughs> I or is it? What, what do you, you believe? What are you doing? I'm just testing. It is one. <laughs> just test. anybody on on Google Chat and uh, can and and Clara can correct me, but yeah, I do believe it is one, one tower. single tower. I believe that's impossible unless you mush them flat like this. All right, on your mark, get set, go. I'm at four. Stevie, you can do running commentary like Jeff Probst. Um, Link is stacking and so is Rhett. They're both <laughs> stacking baby bell cheeses and they are unable to talk, which is why I'm filling the dead air with my talking. This is also how I test my mic when Chris asks me to test my mic. I don't have anything to say. Well, um, it's running commentary. Don't you know how that works in like sports? Okay. She doesn't ready? watch sports. Cassie does. Rhett stacked. Another one. <laughs> Rhett, stack another one again. 15 is gonna be impossible. Link, stacked one. Rhett is having doubts about the number Wait, of, uh, oh, Rhett's tower has fallen. But will he build it back up? Only time will tell. Link is using a technique that I don't know if it's sanctioned by the Baby Bell Olympic Committee. Especially types. But I think that's me, so I'm fine with it. If it means How this many round do I have? is over One, two, sooner. Three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, fifteen. <laughs> <laughs> well, how many do you you have actually nine? Cause your cause Link's tower looks a lot bigger than Rhett's tower. But Rhett also smushed his cheeses, so I'm not 
quite sure. Also, the depth of links being further towards camera is confusing. <laughs> Who'd have thunk it? Why do they all want to? And they continue to stack cheeses. <laughs> oh, is Link's tower going to topple? Nope. It didn't. And Rhett is continuing not to use a mug brace. Oh, Link. Morgan, you hit something. <laughs> Link is blaming Morgan Morgan for his defeat. At some point, at some point, it, it's about time. <laughs> it's about who's got the tallest at the time. Chase is back here as my cheerleader on my commentary, <laughs> encouraging me to continue talking. You know, oh, if, Rhett is Rhett is maybe taking the lead, but I haven't counted. If we would have uh, opened these, it'd be a lot easier. It'd be a lot easier. Oh, maybe that was the secret. How many is that, Rhett? Uh, that is um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. I got 13. <laughs> I mean, I can't let go of it. <laughs> but I got Just 13. put two more, and let's call it a day. Now, if you, I let, I got nine. So, so yeah, I never got to nine. Just without. see what you can get, and then we'll 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 call that the winner. If you can beat nine, that's the standard right now, and then we'll move on to the next one. That's fifteen. That's fifteen. That's fifteen. Rhett has done it. <laughs> <laughs> no, Link officially won that one. Okay, Link officially won that one. The next challenge is the rolling challenge. In this round, you two will compete against each other to see who can successfully roll one Baby Bell cheese all the way across the desk, end to end. Do you understand? Yeah, and not through anything, just across the desk? Do we desk? really need to? Yeah. Well, <clears throat> okay. need. So, you gotta move your Baby Bells out of the way. What's the coverage like on this? None? Yeah, it's, we designed okay. it that way. <laughs> okay, so Rhett's gonna roll and I'm gonna catch. I'll stay on screen. Well, so it's you... the first to do it, so technically you'd both you just, have to do it. You just did it. But... It seemed pretty easy. Okay, see how easy oh, it is. Rhett won this round. <laughs> <laughs> I like... Oh, hey, yeah, yeah, you didn't do it! It fell off! I knew in the round! He won that round. Let me... Okay. Oh, they didn't make it! They didn't make it! They didn't make it! We are tied. This next round is the kicking challenge round. It's Baby Bell football. You will alternate turns between being the kicker and the goalpost. The first athlete to kick two successful Baby Bell field goals will win this event. Are we doing this, I think? Yeah, but first. <laughs> Hello. As you listen to this voicemail greeting, let our voices calm you and remind you to take a minute out of your day and relax. Concentrate on your breath entering through your right nostril while simultaneously leaving through your left nostril. Now see if as you breathe in and breathe out, you can make whistle noises like this. That, that wasn't you, that was us. Don't take credit for our whistling. We'll try you back later. Oh, let's do another one. Hey, you were calling and uh, why are you even doing that? I mean, it's like you were thinking about texting. You probably should have just texted, you know, because now, uh, well, you're you're faced with the, with, the, with the opportunity to leave a voicemail, but who does that? I mean, you're not gonna do it. You're not gonna leave a voicemail. You're just, you're just gonna hang up and then you're gonna text and say, hey, I called you. Um, so this is kind of worthless. I mean, why are you even still listening to me? Leave a message at the beep. <laughs> what's the next What's the next event? It's kicking, man. Okay. Oh, we didn't do that. Oh, yeah. you wanna actually kick? Yeah, I think we got to. You really gotta kick. I think what you gotta do is, if, just for safety, I think you should, you should, and for size, you should be, turn away from me and go like that, and I have to kick over you. So turn away from me. I thought it go was like gonna this. be a thump. No, it's a real kick. Turn around, hands in the air. 
Get a little closer so you're in the shot. Move a little, move a little further away. Okay. Here we go. Hold your arms up higher so I can make sure. Okay. Hey, that would have hurt. That was a, that was definitely a field goal. Well, let me try. To be clear, this is not how this was supposed to go. All right. So here, squat down. Uh, that's far enough. Now I would put your head down. I missed. That wasn't a foot. He automatically disqualified himself. I'm Rhett two. has won this event. All right, I'm up two to one. Okay, this is the mouth slash forehead coordination challenge. Mouth slash forehead <laughs> I'm coordination. I'm reading a column of my scoreboard that's just descriptive and not supposed to be read. Next, we have a two-part event. First, you must transfer a baby bell from your forehead to your mouth without using your hands. And then once you've completed that, you must get the baby bell back to your forehead again without using your hands. Forehead and to your hands? To your with, mouth. To your mouth. mouth. Without and, using your hands. And then from your mouth to your what? Back forehead. to your forehead. Oh gosh. So full circle. Uh, quick reminder and an invitation. Uh, check out our podcast, Ear Biscuits. We have a YouTube channel where you can watch us talk to each other. Uh, we also have just a podcast in audio form. It comes out every Monday. I think you'd learn a lot about us. I think you'd like it. Check it out. I'm going to start a religion where you got to have a cheese eye. Like, do you have cheese a, eye? is it a third eye? No, it's a cheese eye. Oh. All right, so I pushed kind of hard. Let me... Okay, so we got to wiggle it down to the mouth. <laughs> Moving slow. Uh. No. Gotta move slower than that. You have two different wiggle techniques. It's very interesting. Uh. <laughs> Dang it. It's like as soon as it releases. Yeah. I have no once chance. It, once it releases. When I see people do this with things that are not Cheese. How do, how do you keep it? This seems like the perfect thing to give your child aged like four through 12 and then just tell them that they have to do this. I gotta start with a fresh one. That one's gotten too dirty. They could occupy themselves for a really long time. Once it gets to the bridge of the nose, I can't, I just can't. I, can't I haven't even it. gotten to the bridge of the nose. I can't get over my, my brow. No, I'm saying it rolls. I gotta turn my head up when that happens. <laughs> gotta get a new one. Oh, that's okay. No, no, it's not. There's a technique to this, huh? Oh, gosh! Okay, I'm altering the event. You don't have to go from your mouth back up to your forehead yeah. because it's <laughs> taking a long time. Yeah, Clara was a little too confident in our abilities. You're just waiting for time to do its thing? Yeah, it's gonna slowly slide. Look. I'm trying a different technique. Yeah, look. <laughs> oh, gosh! Hey, hey, I, I figured it out. Are you doing what I'm doing? Oh, no, you're not. <laughs> uh, this? I did this first. Yeah, that's what I'm doing now, and it's working. <laughs> oh, gosh! <laughs> this is what we do in the cheese eye religion. <laughs> she just gets to her room, and everybody goes, oh. <laughs> it's like, what's happening to those people? <laughs> They're worshiping cheese. <laughs> oh. Gee, Jesus. <laughs> they're, wor they're worshiping Jesus. Jesus. <laughs> oh, 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 gosh. Oh. Oh. Hey, we're not going to stop until we do it. One of us has to do this.
And the other one has to look, 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 look. almost do it. You're so oh! You shake too much, man. Don't don't get impatient. Jesus Jesus will return. I'm having a Jesus in due time. I'm having a Jesus moment. You know what? Maybe you just gotta go you just gotta go for it like this. I wonder if is it what if you left the wax on or left the uh Then it's not fun. Okay. Cause when it goes in my mouth, I want it to be fun. Oh, son of a My mouth is also pretty small. So if I have if it gets down to it. Oh, oh. What if I did guardrails? Like this. Okay, what if I do guardrails? Like like boulder bumpers? Yeah. My neck's starting to hurt. I won't use them. It's just going to cut. See, it catches it, so then I can start at the top again. That is satisfying. Look at that. Ooh. You don't waste as much cheese this way. I'm going I'm to leave it in this. This, <laughs> this also looks cooler when people walk into the... <laughs> no, you got to keep it like this, Link. Like gills. I did, that's what I did, isn't it? You, you got some gaps in there. You don't let it... You do, Oh, that was close. Oh, oh, look at that. It's just right there in my mouth. <laughs> oh, I got to lean back more. I think when it starts to roll, you got to tip, 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 yeah. tip back. Oh, gosh, my neck is killing me. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh man. What if you could throw it up and then catch it? <laughs> what are those guys staring at? <laughs> what? Are, look up! What are they seeing? What's so mesmerizing? Man, leave it to a new religion to make me feel frustrated. All right, we give up. We can't. No, do no, this. no, no. We're not giving up. I'm sorry. I know you guys want to go to lunch. Just go to lunch. All right, we, let's leave a message while we're doing this, and it's an invitation to come to our meeting. Hello, I'm a member of the Jesus Cult. Thanks for your interest in our organization. If you're wondering what we've been doing on the street corners, <laughs> when, we're, when we're all looking up at the sun, we're just trying to catch cheese in our mouth. No one's ever done it. There's a rumor that so close. There's a rumor that one man actually did successfully get the cheese into his mouth at one point in the distant past. <laughs> Wait, try it like a wheel. Try like it a, like a wheel. Yeah, like roll it, like put it up to roll down the bridge of your nose. Yeah, that's how the enlightenment <laughs> went through. <laughs> it. Zach's saying, stick your tongue out. Stick your tongue you out. You stick your tongue out. <laughs> oh. Oh. Hold on, it went in. Did you roll it down? Uh, yeah, I think that was in. really epic. That's like the most yeah, epic like... thing that's ever happened. Yeah, and I don't know how I did it. Well, okay. <laughs> that's a good joke. It seemed easy, but I can't do it again. There's no way I can do that. Guys, that means it's a tie because Link won this round. <laughs> Boy, it was all worth it, huh? But I'm in heaven now. Yeah, he will be spared now. Oh, it's thank you. Of... Thank you, Chase. He gets to wear the cheese amulet. <coughs> the chamulet. Bow down. I'm not gonna worship you. Look and feel your mythical best with our grooming collection, available at mythical.com.